hi guys welcome back to my channel today's video i have a little different look for you um it's going to be a bold red lip with just a bold liner it's going to be kind of a simple look with just some definition at the same time this look is good for nighttime day day nights just anything you want pretty much you can even wear this in the evening um i added some bold lashes just to give the look even more of a pop and yeah, this is the look that I created for you guys today. I hope that you enjoy it. And if you want to see how I created this look, then just keep on watching. Hey guys, so today's video is going to be really easy. Uh, my face is already done. Uh, I have my foundation, concealer, and my powder, primers, moisturizer, all that good stuff. I just have to add the rest of like, you know, my blush, my contour, which I'm going to be contouring today. I haven't been doing that too often lately, but today I'm gonna contour. So my eyes are already primed. What I'm going to be using now is the Carly Bible palette, which is this one, and it has, you know, um, mine is a little messy. It has the highlights over here, and then the shadows. There are, I think it's 10 shadows, and some of them could be even used as highlighters. This palette is really, really good, I love it. So I'm gonna just be taking this shade right here, which is just kind of a skin tone shade. I'm not gonna be putting um, an eyeshadow on my lid with color, it's just gonna be this because we're gonna be doing a bold uh, black wing liner. So I'm just gonna add that all over my entire lid. I want the attention to go mostly on the wing liner and my lips because I'm going to be wearing a really bold red lip. This is more of a nighttime look. Um, I'm not gonna add any shadow on my lower lash line, just some black eyeliner and that's it. It's gonna be a simple but yet bold at the same time kind of look. You could wear it anytime, daytime or night, but it's probably better off wearing for the evening, like a date night or just somewhere romantic and just, you know, a night thing. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So what I'm going to be doing, fix my hair. Dealing with curly hair is just like, it's, it's just, it's like a job. It's like, it's like having a job dealing with curly hair, especially long curly hair at the same time. I'm going to tight line off camera and I'll be right back. So now what I'm going to do is my black wing liner and I'm going to be using the NYC liquid liner and we're going to just apply a wing. It's going to be bold but not too dramatic. Just a nice wing and let's just hope for the best. You know what, I'm going to start with this one. I like to tilt my head up a little bit. For some reason, it makes it easier for me. Some people just look straight forward and they do it, but I guess the way my eyes are shaped, it's kind of hard for me to do it that way, especially when I'm filming and I have to use one hand. Normally, I, I just have like a hand here and then I'm using my other hand, but just uh, I find that I need to look back, like to tilt my head back a bit. I'm done sweating doing this wing. <laughs> I'm gonna let that dry and I'm going to put some black liner under. I'm gonna put some 
black eyeliner on my waterline. The e.l.f. mineral eyeliner is really creamy. So I'm just gonna add some mascara on my top and bottom lashes. This is the Telescopic by L'Oreal. you guys notice I don't always curl my lashes that's because my lashes are they don't they're not too curly but they do have a curl to them so I don't always curl my lashes sometimes I forget to do it but for, for the most part I don't really care to curl my lashes because they kind of have a curl to them already the elf cosmetics bronzer palette I use this quite a bit and I'm going to be, I guess, taking a little bit of all of them, except for the shimmery ones. I'm going to be taking these three right here. And I'm going to just bronze a little. to be contouring which if you guys notice I don't contour too much uh, but I'm going to today because we have a simple kind of look with just a little bit of boldness so I'm gonna be using MAC medium dark or the right angles contour palette it's a lot. <laughs> um, this is what it looks like I think this is kind of a highlight I haven't really used it much but then this is the contour so I'm gonna be using this and I guess I can use this little mirror here. So next I'm going to be putting on some blush. I'm going to be using the Glamorous Blush Palette by Blush Cosmetics. It looks like this. It's very pretty. And today I'm actually going to use this one right here, which is uh, mostly the one that I use. You guys know that I blend everything out. I just want it to blend together. I don't like anything looking too much like it's just sitting on my face with a lot of pigment. I'm gonna be using the same Dodo lashes I've been using. Um, if you guys noticed in my videos, I've said in my, mostly in my videos that I had in the beginning, that lashes have been a struggle for me. I'm still not really into lashes, but I've come to realize that lashes go really well with the majority of looks that you do. So I'm kinda starting to get into lashes more so I tend to use the same lashes because I don't have that many and it's just because I'm starting to slowly get into lashes and you know hopefully I'll start hopefully I'll start getting more so I can incorporate them in my videos but I'm not really too much into lashes I would prefer to not use them but they just complete the look so I'm gonna be using the duo glue in black this is a dark tone only because we have such a bold wing so It'll be perfect for this. We won't have to worry too much about, you know, um, getting it on our liner because it's going to come out as the same color pretty much. While that dries, I'm going to go on to my highlight. I'm so, so fortunate to have won a giveaway that my friend Mrs. Clemente, I think it is. Please don't kill me if I said it wrong, but I think that's how you say it, Mrs. Clemente. Um, I have her on YouTube and Instagram and I actually won her giveaway. She had the Wet n Wild highlighters that are sold out everywhere. I've tried so many different stores. I've had friends of mine looking for them and those highlighters are just like almost impossible to find. And she actually had a giveaway. I entered not thinking that I would win and I actually did. So the one I'm going to be using today is the Precious Petals which is the most talked about one. It's closed, as you guys can see. It's a brand new one. 
I have the other one that's also peach. So I'm really excited to try this. I wanted this highlight for so long and it's just always sold out. Even on the Wet n Wild website, it's always sold out. I never find it, but I'm just happy I won the giveaway. So thank you for having this giveaway, girl, because I'm definitely happy that I won. And this is what it looks like. It has a little flowery picture on the highlight. It's really, really, really pretty. So we're gonna be using that today before the lash glue dries. And I'm just gonna take it that. Apply my lash now. I'm gonna use my finger. These are like the easiest lashes to apply. take that same highlighter that I use from Wet n Wild and I'm just going to pop it right here. I'm gonna be using Ruby Woo by MAC and the Ruby Woo lip liner as well. Okay guys, so this is the final look. I hope that you guys enjoyed this kind of romantic day night um, look with a bold wing liner and red bright bold lips. Let me know what you guys want to see. I'll be glad to do it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and subscribe to my channel before you leave and also give me a thumbs up. I'm almost at 200 subscribers on YouTube and I just hit 3k and some change on Instagram. So thank you guys so much for the support. I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.